LIMS Administration Introduction Laboratory Information Management Systems are computer-driven integrated systems that record data for the user in order to perform general maintenance tasks and reporting. These systems collect the data, collate the data, parse the data, and archive the data. With this structure, the data can be formatted to provide a wide range of services for the end user. Such services include monitoring production rates and inventory, tracking quality of product, and predicting manufacturing trends. But these systems can do so much more. A properly designed and monitored system can provide insight into inner workings of the manufacturing process so intuitive that the user can watch the degradation of equipment and forestall breakdowns, evaluate production problems associated with individual employees, and even optimize product qualities to reduce costs. The original purpose of these systems was to monitor laboratory equipment and lab test results, but the systems have proven themselves so versatile that they now envelop entire production facilities and provide statistical process control plant-wide. A properly designed and implemented system tracks virtually every facet of manufacture, allowing proper chain of custody control over samples and products. Standard operating procedures, material safety data sheets, business plans, EPA methods, and a myriad of other documentations can be directly linked to each and every stage of product manufacture, from purchasing to shipping automatically. Digital signatures allow the LIM system the ability to track conditions related to individual employees, which often detects habits that affect the outcome of product quality. Reports generated by the system can be tailored to individual needs based upon user profiles. Changes in procedure, raw material suppliers, and information can be monitored closely by this system, allowing the user to make changes on the fly without lost production time or filled batches. Design of experimentation can be applied directly to manufacturing, allowing for optimization of product manufacture. Statistical process control ensures product quality throughout the process going one step further than the standard hazard analysis critical control points that have become the industry standards. The system proves itself by improving conditions for the production crews, purchasing agents, and shipping departments by eliminating questionable steps or avoiding lost paperwork. On the downside, and yes there is a downside, if the system is not implemented properly, the LIM system can slow down the facility and even cause more problems than it is worth. I am sure that the listener has bought what they thought would be the perfect program for their computer, maybe a calendar program or a music database that they read about in a magazine. But when they tried to use it, they lost business card files or were unable to find their favorite songs. I consider myself to be somewhat of a computer geek, and yet I still find software to be aggravating when I start using it. Therein lays the problem with computers and software. If you do not take the time to learn the program to its fullest capacity, you often overlook the positive aspects of the program and focus on the negative. Limb systems are so involved with the production methodology that if improperly used and operated, they can in a short time destroy a company's good name through data corruption or misinterpretation of results. Care must be taken to ensure that if you are adding this type of system to your production facility, you also provide a dedicated and well-trained individual to maintain the system. When I say well-trained individual, I mean someone who is very well-trained in every aspect of production and manufacturing. The right person would be able to step into any of the jobs he is working with and do the work as if born to the job. He must understand purchasing and the need for predicting raw material purchasing, inventory reporting, and supply problems. He must be able to walk up to the batch process, put on some gloves, and blend a perfect batch just by reading the tickets and following the SOPs. He should understand the QCQA process and lab techniques as if he has a degree in chemistry. He should be able to talk the talk and walk the walk of a shipping clerk, salesman, or engineer. You should be comfortable with this person sitting in on corporate meetings to develop proper reports for the CEO, CFO, and President. This person also needs to be a superior computer geek. He will in time write programs and repair computer hardware. If he can't read a PNID of your plant, then he isn't the right man for the job. This is all because he will be highly involved with every one of these duties to provide reports and ensure no important aspect of the job is left uncovered. 
Consider what would happen if the shipping department did not receive a batch failure notice on time and had to issue a public recall of a product. What if the CEO got such a large report of useless data that he called you to find out why? How about noticing a degradation trend in testing equipment, like the loss of resolution in the results from a gas chromatograph? How would that affect the quality of your primary product line if not fixed in a timely manner? What happens to production when supplies of raw materials are consistently late because the limbs guy doesn't know certain supply houses take two weeks to ship? The next few presentations will describe where the problems occur and how they should be addressed by your limbs superman.